and to the point where we've been concerned about how the, you know, that active shooter situation. Yes. That's kind of where we've gotten it. It's, it's been a lot and it's been scary. Mm -hmm. I have told, I have been in contact with the police for over the years and told him exactly that. I said, he's going to be that guy. He's going to be that guy. We need to get him taken care of. But he had absolute power of control of my mother's, illegally, he went and took her in with, without our consent and um, got complete power and control. So we couldn't do, our hands were tied and, and everybody's hands were tied. But he is that guy, he's up his rocket. And he is dangerous. And, uh, and he, like, as you see, the city of Battleground now wants him to, you know. They want him to, are they going to okay, domestic this violence, no contact. So but, but there's four of us that have, my mother, Mary, me, um, and the city of Battleground, all have no contact orders in the last The city of Battleground got one against him? Yes, that's what this is. Because they don't want him to come to the city of Battleground? Yes, they're trying to. Yeah. Yeah. See, that's, and the police. I, you know, I don't know where this will go, but if there comes a proper warning point and you need additional evidence, you could probably uh, I, there will check be. the inspection service because we, we got there with him. You got what? The inspection service. Okay, so, so um, can you give me any... A number or could you write that down? It's like because I can't remember everything. There's so much. I've got like a car full of papers. Well, I can't. Inspection service. Okay. Postal inspection service. About him coming here every day. It's just horrible. Does he make a scene and, and yeah, demand? Yeah. He won't leave. Or Thank you. Uh, just too much. Okay, so is that something I need or is that This yours? is something I need. I just okay. took a copy of the back Thank page you. Okay. for Marilyn Wood. Well, let me tell you, besides helping my mother, which she was on the verge of death, and she is on the road to recovery, we're going to get her out of here. We're getting her out of here. We're working for you guys, too. We're working for the police, too, because they're at their wits' end also. Yeah. It's just a nightmare. And we don't know what's wrong with him, but you know what? I'm not worried about him. I'm going to well, worry you know, about my I, mother. My first impression was not that really could be Terry Stark, but that he was doing drugs. Yeah, what, I know. I've been hearing that he's doing like a meth or something, like cocaine. Or, or I don't know, something. but his eyes glowed. Okay. okay. He's got beautiful eyes. It's too bad. It's just too bad. Yeah. I don't know. It's so good. I hope that all gets It will, with your help, with people like you. Thank you for sharing that with me because that means a lot. It means a lot. That it gives me more fire. Yes. Okay, bye now. Oh my God. Did you hear that? They think he might become an active shooter. And I agree. Okay. This is the post office. Hi. Oh, thank you, sir. Yeah. I opened the door for a 30-year-old gal. She just marches through. Oh, I know. I, I appreciate it. But I'm, I'm still from that era, you know. Yeah. That so we don't want to see chivalry die. Please. <laughs> yeah. Thank you so much. Take care. Thank you. Okay.